Hello everybody, Conti here with another video. How to use the change clip duration feature in DaVinci Resolve 17.1. Inside my current project timeline in the edit window, I have two separate video clips alongside one another. The first is a 10 second neon lights video clip, followed by a 5 second Inferno Flame MP4 file. Using the selection mode tool, which you can also do by pressing A, the duration of a media clip already on the timeline can be altered manually by clicking and dragging at the end of the relevant edit. Like in this example where I've reduced the neon laser light edit by 4 seconds to a 6 second total duration. As an alternative, the change clip duration option is available by right clicking on the relevant media file on your edits timeline and selecting the relevant option from the menu or by selecting the relevant media file and holding in control and pressing D. Use command instead of control if you are a Mac user. The current total duration is stored in the second value box inside the change clip duration window. Again, this can be modified manually using your mouse by selecting the second pair of digits from the right side, which represent the seconds. If I change from six seconds to eight seconds and click change, we can see a length alteration of the media clip on the timeline. A set of timing values available from DaVinci Resolve is available just above the change button. If I select the 5S button for example, the duration will be modified to 5 seconds. The end button restores the media clip to its original maximum length. If I select this and click change, the original 10 second duration for the Neon Lines video is restored. How can we use the second formatting option of frames though? If you right click on the relevant media clip and select clip attributes, the top property for this video's clip attributes displays the frame rate at 24. Hence why this particular video clip with the neon lights comprises of 240 stills. If we change this to 239, one frame now separates the neon laser video clip from the Inferno flame effect. A video clip cannot be expanded beyond its maximum length. On the other hand, image files that you import from your project's media pool, such as JPEG or PNG files, such as this one for example, can be expanded beyond their default duration, such as the incrementation of this PNG file from 120 to 220 frames. The same effect can be applied to filters inside the effects library, such as Fusion Composition, where I will increase the length from 5 to 7 seconds. You can tell when you can expand beyond a default length where the end option alongside preset is not available. Bear in mind that positions of subsequent clips are consistent when media file durations are shortened, such as the neon laser line video staying where it is after we adjust the duration of the Inferno Flame video. Expanding the length of media file clips could result in subsequent media files on the edit timeline being overwritten. Like the start of the neon laser line video here being overwritten by the Inferno Flame video. Thank you very much for watching, I hope that video was useful to you. If you found the content helpful and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Join me soon for another video, take care.